Hello everyone, in this bulletin of positive news stories, we will share with you stories of strong willpower, dedication, kindness and inspiration. So let's get started with the top positive news stories that can bring smile and joy on your face amid these difficult times. It's a very inspiring story of Kerala parents and son who passed class 12th together and have proven that it's never too late to study. Setting an example that it's never too late to study, a couple in Kerala's Mamallapuram have passed class 12th examinations along with their son. Muhammad Mustafa and his wife Nusaiba had passed class 12th exams on March 19. Four months later, their son Shamas also passed the class 12th exams with good marks. The 43-year-old Mustafa is a businessman who started working shortly after completing his class 10th. After working for years at veterinary cleaning at Abu Dhabi, he got married to Nusaiba. They moved to Gulf, but Nusaiba was regretting not completing class 12th. When they returned to Kerala five years ago, Mustafa began inquiring about writing class 12th exams. He came to know about the Kerala Literacy Mission's equivalency exams in which both the husbands and wife enrolled Sunday for Sunday classes. Mustafa told that his son was very excited to know about the enrollment and he used to help them with all the doubts and questions. Nusaiba scored good marks of 80% and Mustafa scored first class. Mustafa said that he and his wife did not tell about writing exams to anyone in the family because they felt embarrassed. But they understood that there is no reason to be embarrassed when they got to know and when they got getting congratulatory messages on this. The couple said that they have managed to inspire some people that it's new, never too late to study more. This is a story of sheer inspiration. World famous and star chef Vikas Khanna has achieved the milestone of distributing 25 million meals so far to the needy during these uncertain times. He said that the, he dedicates this moment to our national treasure and singer Lata Mangeshkar. Khanna lives in Manhattan, but that does not stop him from doing this wonderful work. He has been coordinating massive food drives in India ever since the lockdowns began. Now, he says that his next goal is to arrange and distribute 10 million meals to street vendors all over the country. This will continue for at least three months and he has already shortlisted 20 cities for the distribution. He started the largest food drive in the world called Barkat and Feed India campaign since June. He ensured the distribution of food and care to afflicted communities like transgenders, differently abled and sex workers who had to face the hardships due to pandemic. Not only this, he has also distributed more than 3 million sanitary pads around India. Vikas Khanna is also working on providing 2 million meals food, clothes and essentials like mosquito repellents, candles and matches to people in flood ravaged areas like Bihar and Assam. Now let me share a story of dedication and inspiration. On 3rd August, Chhattisgarh police created a world record by distributing 14 lakh masks within 6 hours. The Chhattisgarh police received a world record certificate from the Golden Book of World Record for distributing 14 lakh masks just within 6 hours. The Chhattisgarh police was running this campaign to create awareness to use face masks to prevent the spread of COVID-19 in Raigar district. This initiative was led by Raigar district police chief Santosh Kumar Singh in which the police personnel distributed the masks. He told the media that the team and volunteers received impressive response and praise from everyone and all residents of Raigar who made this campaign called Ek Raksha Shotra Mask Ka hugely successful. Around 362 Organizations and over 7,500 volunteers participated in this event and campaign on the occasion of Raksha Bandhan. The campaign has received praise and accolades from everywhere. Now let me share a story of kindness and care of COVID-cured man from Patna who gives free mobile oxygen cylinders to patients. Gaurav Rai is a resident of Patna who has been cured of COVID-19. He said that he was taken to Patna Medical College and Hospital on July 14th and his wife had to struggle a lot to get oxygen cylinder for him. This episode changed him completely and now he has started mobile oxygen bank after defeating the virus himself. He runs this free mobile oxygen bank from his car. It started with around 30 cylinders which the couple purchased from their savings. Gaurav Raya said that he is arranging more money from friends and families to increase the number of oxygen cylinders. This Patna man has saved at least 8 COVID positive people. There are many others on oxygen support because of his help. He has donated blood for more than 86 times to save lives. He has also donated plasma to more than 6 times to 
for the treatment of other patients. He becomes available on call to give free oxygen cylinder for everyone and anyone in the state. That's all for the positive news bulletin. Thanks for watching. We'll be back very soon with lot more positive news stories.